have a wife that dotes on me. She's in the house right now baking cookies. I haven't played video games in a while, and yesterday she convinced me to sit down and that I should play some video games. She convinced me that I should. We have horses, and cats, and dogs, and animals, a Noah's Ark, if you will. Instead of being that brooding, dark, insufferable person I was before that did nothing but fix things for everyone else, I wake up to the laughter of my children and the joy of my family and my wife. And none of that would be possible if it wasn't for my reign. The opinion of jealous people is irrelevant. Because I have my reign. I have my boys. I have my life. And though yes, I also have one of the the worst headaches ever. The oxygen seems to be helping. I don't see how anyone could look at my life before my wife and say that now I'm missing anything. Hi everyone, and thank you for returning to my channel. Join us today to learn about the tragic accident that happened to Noah Brown and the truth behind his departure from the show. At the end of the video, I'll reveal some secrets about Noah Brown, so watch this video through to the end. The real-life adventures of the Alaskan Bush-dwelling Brown family are documented in the television series Alaskan Bush People. This program on Discovery Channel explores their life while living in the icy desert. One of the highlights of Alaskan bush people is Noah Brown, the second oldest of seven brothers. He is the most handsome brother in addition to being the most intelligent. Given his intriguing demeanor, it would seem natural that fans would be interested in learning more about Brown's life outside of the program. Alaskan bush people on the Discovery Channel contributed to the ascent to fame. The majority of Billy Brown's family still resides on a mountain in the state of Washington. Although he passed away in 2021 from a fatal seizure on September 18, 1984, the Brown family had lived their entire lives in the forest because their parents, Billy and Amy, wished to live off the grid. Noah Brown was born in Texas. His parents, Billy and Amy Brown, decided to raise their family independently in the Alaskan wilderness. So when he was just 18 weeks old, they moved to Alaska. While growing up on the family fishing boat, he developed his tracking, hunting, fishing, and hard survival skills. He also showed a strong interest in technology and electronics. Although he did not receive a formal education, he learned from books and the parents of his brothers, his combative and vivacious nature led to the creation of his moniker, Noah Brown. Brown's love of adventure and the great outdoors has influenced his growth and job decisions. In addition to being well known for his tracking, fishing, hunting, and tough survival skills, he started his career in 2014 with the reality show Alaskan Bush People. The show also highlights his family's unique and difficult life in the Alaskan wilderness. He also loves technology and gadgets, and on family vacations, he frequently brings a camera to capture the special moments. He calls this place Boathouse Fathom, and on one of his favorite episodes, he and his brother Null worked with Allison to build a wind turbine to power their lodging. The only other television program where No Brown has appeared is Alaskan Bush People. Considering how isolated and alone the Brown family's life was, 
It is amazing how little opportunities they had for more in-depth human contacts. The second oldest son also talks about his partner Allison Kagan, who he says is his partner since Joshua left the program. It's no secret that he enjoys working with Ally. The two lifestyles have been getting along and coexisting peacefully as teammates and employees for a while now. On the set of the show, Noah Brown and Rahan live together on what looks like an exotic boat, but is actually an amazing ship that each of them painstakingly restored and reconstructed together. They rode the state and island fury and experienced the thrill of boat ownership. Ryan searched for a boat, but she couldn't find one that was nearly as good as the other. Ryan is a devoted traveler and music enthusiast who holds a certification in parrot culture design tragic accident. She graduated from the University of New York at Albany with a degree in both cinema and communications. Over her illustrious television career, Ryan has contributed to several networks and shows. She also runs her own company, Caden Creative. A terrible car accident claimed the lives of two people and featured a BAM after receiving minimal medical attention. Noah Brown is not at fault when the two cars crash at corners. The most recent incident involving Noah Brown happened on US Route 97 when a Chibi Camaro entered the oncoming queue of traffic. Noah Brown reportedly rushed his own GMC vehicle to get around the approaching car and ended up in a ditch. Noah Brown was allowed to leave the hospital. It's claimed that the Chevy Camaro has it was unclear at the time if drug or alcohol use contributed to the collision, so Noah Brown gets all the credit for getting his car out of danger when it whirled around crossed the center highway line and stopped with its back to his vehicle. The two dead women, Lauren Martinez Gonzalez and Gabriela Garcia Harrison, were both Washington residents. Noah Brown, who has been embroiled in a number of scandals, has not yet addressed the fatal car accident, and it is unlikely that it will be mentioned in his story in the upcoming season of Alaskan Bush. Being the second oldest Brown person, Person B has a reputation for being quite quiet and reserved. Therefore, it's unlikely that he will talk about how he survived the horrific incident. A why God Brown has had a lengthy legal history. In 2015, he and his father Billy were charged with filing fraudulent claims for an Alaska Permanent Fund dividend. They pleaded guilty to a single count of second-degree unsworn falsification which led to 60 counts of first- and second-degree theft and first-degree uncorn falsification. They were both placed on probation as a result. What is occurring as it does so in the Brown family, everyone is curious as to whether Noah Brown has already visited his mother in the hospital or whether he plans to do so in the future. Everyone is shocked that he hasn't been around as often as the rest of the family. Amy Brown is not doing well and has hinted that her days on Earth may not be long. Many find it odd that No Brown would not want to spend the next several months with his mother, although he may still visit her. Amy acknowledges that her illness is at stage 3, although some sources place it in stage 4. Her admirers would really want to know. Though his work in reality TV is his primary source of income, he also makes money from other endeavors like music. In conclusion, Noah Brown's unique way of life and diverse skill set have enabled him to amass a substantial wealth. Although living in the Bahamas would make it difficult for Noah Brown and his fancy to see one another frequently, it would be surprising if his family chose to pay them a visit. Additionally, there have been rumors circulating that they are either married or planning a wedding. Additionally, Noah Brown Burr is well known for his charitable activities. His contribution of a percentage of his riches to philanthropic organizations has further improved his public image. Thanks for watching my video.